Hello there, I'm the base manager and welcome back to Project Zomboid. Now, today we found ourselves in our little home. Um, now, we already have a little bit of loot, nothing too fancy. We have some food on us that should last us a couple of days. And, uh, well, we need uh, direction. Uh, given that this is going to be... Um, somewhat of a nomad playthrough, I think it would be a good idea uh, to find a car and a generator um, and a gas can uh, as well uh, because uh, those are the things we need to make uh, gas station work, right? So um, we should try to focus on that uh, make a bowl of oatmeal. Let's prepare breakfast. We are a little bit hungry, so um, let's try to take care of that. However, this should last us the rest of the day. Oh shit, we have to go outside and take care of business. Close the door. Where are you, Mr. Zombie? Oh! Uh, see, this house is not exactly a safe location to be. We need to um, go towards the um, other side of the city, where the uh, houses with two stories are located. Okay, there is someone knocking on our windows. Or maybe not. Maybe there were just uh, two of the uh, of them. Yeah, because I don't feel safe sleeping in here, knowing that that uh, this flimly, flimsy piece of wood is the only thing that uh, separates us from a horde of um, brain-eating zombies, right? So my idea is let's try to clear a path towards the gas station, see if we can find any cars in there. Hopefully, if we are lucky, we will be able to uh, find a car that is um, in good condition, has a key, um, the battery is working, uh, has gas, you know, all the things, all the things that we want. Let's see, are we attracting attention? Just this guy. Um, when we have the chance of taking them down one by one, we should take it. Um, they are far easier to deal with one-on-one uh, -on -one than they are in a group. So let's see if we can uh, sneak by these guys. Maybe they uh, will lose interest. Or maybe not because uh, those guys are also interested in uh, a piece of us. So let's take care of this one. And this one should be next. Let's try to keep one side of the road clear, at least. Ooh, vitamins. There is another one interested. Yep. I don't really want to uh, fight all the zombies that stand in my way until I reach the gas station. Like to oh a Russell map. Oh shit! I missed that. Stay down. Like that and the Riverside map. Okay. Those three three things go into our backpack and let's continue. Hopefully these guys will uh, ignore us when we'll be able to sneak through these uh, two groups. Maybe not. If we are um, fast on our feet, they will uh, ignore us. Or maybe not. Let's just see what uh, the situation looks like, looks like in here. Yeah. We have a couple of cars, a few groups of zombies. Eventually they will lose interest on us. 
that car seems to be in good condition. Oh, and there is a key on the floor. Let's try to scoop this up. There we go, and I think it's for that car, so uh, maybe our prayers were answered. We just need to clear ourselves some space. So let's take let's try to take care of that. Oh shit. It's not going to work. Yep. That's what I thought. Okay. Well, that was never going to work, was it? Maybe we can just... break their line of sight and maybe they will uh, lose interest on us, or maybe not. The fact that I am getting a little bit exerted is preoccupying me, so um, let's loop around this place again. Try to break some line of sight. Maybe some of them will lose interest. Or maybe not. Okay, but at least we know there is a car in here. And the fact that we already agitated some zombies, it's not the worst thing in the world, okay. So in front of me things are relatively clear, so we are... Our backs are safe, let's try to um, just deal with these ones are coming one after the other, come on go down please. Go down. Yeah, good boy. Okay. So we have a little bit of room to breathe. And to start clearing some zombies. However, if I am uh, sneaking, sneaky enough, I can just come to this car and see how it looks like. No gas, everything sucks. Okay. Well. One can hope for, right? Trunk? Nope. Nothing. Okay. Well. They say hope dies uh, is the last thing to die, right? We still should uh, clear the gas station, though. So let's attempt to do that, or at least just the building, maybe we can find some gas cans in there. At least one piece of the puzzle would be taken care of, right? Right, okay. Just take a quick look at these guys, see if they have anything that uh, might interest us. Doesn't seem like it. But well, given that this was kind of a bust, right? After we are done with the gas station, uh, our focus should be um, on clearing a path towards the other side of the city so we can um, get ourselves into a uh, two-story house, right? So we can have a little bit of a better safe house while we are organizing our stuff in, the, in uh, this place uh, before we can uh, start um, you know, moving toward the, through the world. It is, it is not the worst thing in the world to have a safe house. Okay, if you're going to ignore me, I'm just going to take a look. Uh, 
Well, there is uh, someone inside. Probably in the um, either in the back door. Oof. God knows what uh, over there. Well, these seem to be safe enough. Let's remove the glass. And let's just take a quick look inside. Just as a precaution. Tire, cupcake, orange soda. Oh, there is definitely someone inside. Okay, they are knocking on the door. That's okay. Let's start taking some, some things. Yeah, I should have uh, just taken, taken all of it. Another orange, orange soda. Given that we have no water, that is kind of handy. Tires, we don't need that. Unfortunately, no gas can. But, uh, well, we still have some uh, good stuff out of that, so uh, not going to complain too much. Okay, let's get out of here. The rest can stay, we are going to come back in any case, so we can take it later. You do, you knock all the things, do, all, do whatever you want. Um, well, given that... Oh, okay, it's raining again, sure. Uh, but uh, as uh, I was about to say, given that we... Um, gather a little bit uh, of candy and uh, ships and whatnot, let's just have something to eat to take care of that hunger. Let's take care of this guy. Ooh, a bit of blockers. Less zombies we drag with us on our way back, the better. Given that we probably have drawn some attention to us. Well, there is that van over there all by itself. It would be a shame if I didn't check it, right? It seems to be in bad condition, but hey, if it runs, we ain't complaining. Someone is coming. Fuck it. Just you, okay, come here, come here. To the ground with you. Okay, let's just take a look at that van. All by itself. We might even get inside the police station. We don't have a sledgehammer though, so... Uh, there is plenty of action inside. Everything is locked. Okay. We will let them do their thing while we do ours. Uh, you're you're already hungry, really, my friend. You just ate a bag of chips. No, I, I know it's not the most. Uh, ooh, that guy has an apron. It's not the most nutritious thing in the world, but still, full bag of chips. Should have you stuffed for a little bit, but oh well. In any case, um, given that we had no luck over there, even though it looked uh, promising at uh, at start, uh, those two cars over in that corner were pretty busted, so I'm pretty sure they are not running. It's not even worth to uh, try to clear those zombies to take a look. Uh, the red car, however, was in good condition, but uh, well. No gas, no battery, and uh, the engine is kind of destroyed. I mean, I can take care of you, I think. There's no one else chasing me, so... Why not? So, another thing we can do is start moving towards 
the other side of the city, city right? Uh, these guys are a little bit too close for comfort, so I'm just going to take them out. Uh, we might still need to spend another night in here, so... Um, taking care of these two girls over here. Not a bad idea at all. They are they might, they are in range that they could just uh, come... Oh shit. They can come um, towards this area during the night while we sleep, you know. Um, yeah, we still have a lot of daytime left, so um, I say we go back through here. Make sure everything is cleared in here. That our uh, puny little safe house is still safe. The only, th only thing that makes this uh, area a safe house is the fact that there is no zombies around it. Because, um... Nothing else. What? You wanna smoke? Wanna smoke break? Okay. Um... Ooh, drop in frames. Uh, kill this Z over here, and then we can uh, take a break in here. Just so that you can smoke in uh, a relatively dry environment. We cleared this area, right? We did. Come on. Have your smoke break. You deserved it. It's not your fault that the gas station is bust is a bust, right? And there is a zombie nearby. A zombie that should be taken care of. Uh, in any case, uh, our uh, task shouldn't be too difficult, because uh, the only thing we have to do is to go uh, towards this uh, street over here, in the intersection, this one, make sure that uh, we clear everything in that direction, right? So let's take care of these zombies. Go down. Now, these two gentlemen over here. In this case, this lady and this gentleman. Come here, lady. You first. Ladies first. I'm a gentleman, after all. Uh, sir, if you could uh, accompany your wife to the same spot. One table per customer, please. Or per couple, in this case. Uh, we have all these um, railers here, which uh, are going to prove themselves uh, useful in the future. Well, this shouldn't be uh, too difficult. The street looks uh, relatively deserted, so uh, we should be able to uh, find a clear path there. Although I hear a bunch of zombies all over the place. Yep, there are still a few stragglers, but uh, right now they are not uh, bothering us. So, uh, we, we, we will leave them be. Uh, I really don't want to focus too many... Oh, my hand just slipped. I don't want to uh, focus too many of our energies in here if we don't have to given that uh, we are going to live on the other side of the city. Well, you're a little, a little bit too close for comfort, so... You can go down. Oh! Vehicle. Completely busted. But uh, we can, you know, give it a try. You never know, and he, if, it, if he, it runs... Um, a busted vehicle is still a good weapon against zombies, so... Uh, if we need to do a large-scale uh, clearing, we can always reverse a van that it is kind of busted. But, uh, the trunk doesn't mind, right? Oh, uh, you're thirsty. Drink half of this. Well, I 
searched the rest of this. Uh, well, a little bit of candy never hurted anyone. Alright, anything in the trunk? Nope, disappointment. Uh, this car, however, looks uh, to be in good condition. Maybe our luck will uh, turn out to be... Uh... Shit. I kinda don't want to destroy a window if I don't have to. Damn. How good of a condition are you? Let's see. Really, really, really good condition. Do you have gas? You have gas. Your battery? It's not dead. Oh, sweet lord. We... Uh, maybe if we search the school, we could find the key for it. If we're lucky. Okay, this is a um, a car to be remembered. To, uh, to keep a mental note on. Because uh, if we get the electrician... Uh, electrical le level 1, we can hotwire it and just uh, be gone with it. It, ha it has gas, the battery is good, we could break the passenger side window open the and uh, open the door like uh, through there, you know. And then we can even replace it later on. Okay, there is another car over there that seems to be in good condition. More cars over there, so... Um, how about... Ooh, there are more over here than I uh, was expecting, okay. Let's pull them back, let's guide them a little bit. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Off the roads, off the road, if at all possible. Shit. Nice. Okay. Uh, I don't see any zombies, we could... Oh, there is a few zombies. There is, a couple of them. And they're coming. Okay. 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 <laughs> These two ladies had the exact uh, same haircut. Maybe they were buddies. Who just went to the salon before the uh, apocalypse uh, breaked out. Because uh, even after one year of being a corpse, their hair looked uh, pretty well done. So uh, congrats on that uh, hairdresser, whoever uh, he, or she, he or she was. She or he did a very nice job. In any case, we're not here to talk about dresses, or in this case, haircuts. Oh, shit. <clears throat> This car seems to be in good condition as well. Uh, but there are zombies in the area. Let's just do a quick check. Quick, 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 quick. Out of gas. Not going anywhere. No oh, shit. Uh, you broke the window and you're not coming. <coughs> That's kind of rude, you know. Okay, it's getting late, so uh, let's just poke a little bit more. Uh, but uh, if the streets are going to be cleared like this, we... M oh, that's a sizable group, but okay. I don't want to jinx myself, but I feel like there is uh, less zombies in uh, Riverside this time around than uh, it was in uh, West Point. West Point, it was just brutal. And I didn't mess with the... Uh, it's the same zombie count. Oh shit. Uh, the settings are the same, so... Uh, I don't know. I don't want to jink myself and have a, a bajillion zombies in the place that I want to go, so... Uh, There we go. It's just at the, the way back. Um, okay, this is the corner that we need to cut. 
we need to go through here, keep going forward, and we should be there in no time. In fact, I think I'm just going to keep on going and maybe we can find a, a place to uh, spend the night in there, you know? And then we will come back uh, and pick up our stuff later. The stuff it's not going anywhere. It's not like the zombies uh, are going to steal our shit, so... If we, if we can find a way... What uh, clothings are those? Oh, they are not camo. Oh, but I think you have an apron. Kinda want that. Hopefully you are uh, on your own. Apparently that's the case. Sir? Sir? Is that an apron? No. It looked like one. Okay. Uh, okay, this is the church. This should be relatively well populated, so let's try to avoid drawing too much attention to ourselves. There are more coming. I'm starting to get exerted. And thirsty. Bring the rest. Okay, have a sip. Take a moment to breathe. All right. Yeah, that's the street and that's the fence. After that fence is a safety. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Please give me that. We will not uh, rely too much on farming uh, this time around, given that we will be moving uh, from place to place. But still, if we can uh, get some farming done eventually, that would be nice, because we could pickle uh, things, right? And take those things with us on our journeys. A few cards. Oh, well, that's a large group. Just keep going, keep going. They will ignore you. No, they will not. Oh, oh no, that's really... That's not what I wanted. Okay, this can be dealt with. This can be dealt with. Okay, maybe this, cannot, this can't be dealt with. Run. Let's kite them back, let's kite them back. Let's not be stupid about it, okay. There are a lot of them. In fact, what I think I'm going to do... It's uh, because we... Um, oh no, uh, uh, equip in both hands, please. Try not to take uh, too long. Okay. Just for this guy, uh, for this group. Drop. You need to start dropping those guys. I'm starting to run out of room. Let's take a look. Everything is still okay. Oh shit. Ooh. That was a close one. Go down. Bad boy. Alright. Let's sit down for a moment and take a deep breath. I'm starting to get a little bit drowsy and it's getting late, but uh, that small group that was blocking our way we dealt with uh, with it and um, yeah. I deserve a uh, a cookie. No, the cookie has uh, happiness on it. Uh, 
put all of these in my backpack while we uh, wait. It also has an happiness on it, so we'll keep it for now. Um, we'll take the pop, however. It's thirst and hunger at the same time, so... Drop it on the floor. Put the key in its place. Uh, this can go in the backpack for now. Alright. Let's just search these corpses. Uh, just do a quick search. Make sure that uh, we don't leave anything useful behind. Doesn't look like it. Now, I do have the beta blockers on me, so I should start using those in situations like this. I actually even remember the uh, the beta blockers uh, mid-fight, but uh, I, it's not like I was going to stop uh, to take one right. Okay, okay, okay. It is doable. We, we are only drowsy. And uh, we might be able to sneak past this group over here. It, uh, it's only two of them now. It's not like they are a big threat. Now, this group uh, followed us, right? Yes, now there are a lot of zombies in here in the back. Okay. Yeah, I think we might be a little bit over our, our head. Uh, trying to uh, sleep in, in one of these houses today because, uh, well, first we had to clear the house, we had to clear all the zombies around the house, and um, there are still a lot of them. Okay, I think I'm going to make my way back home now. Uh, so I'm just going to ignore them, keep on walking. They will give up eventually, and tomorrow we will come around and once again try to clear all the zombies out of the way. Given that we are not going to lose our time in the gas station, we might have a chance of getting um, a new safe house uh, tomorrow. So, um, yeah, unless something critical happens, like uh, me being stupid and going uh, the long way and attracting a bunch of zombies, um, I will see you guys uh, tomorrow. So, uh, please give me a moment and we'll be right back without zombies preferably okay guys so finally back home but apparently we have a few visitors I cannot uh, see them but I can hear them where do you think they are here in the back nope they're around here somewhere not in here what the hell are these guys? I don't like to know that uh, we have zombies so close to our... Okay. Here's one. And I can hear thumping. Some thumping. Where the hell are these guys? Are they inside now? Oh, what the hell? Oh shit. I don't feel safe. Well, they are around here somewhere. Well, guys, fingers crossed. Okay, everything uh, seems to be turning out uh, okay. Uh, let's fill our empty uh, bottles. This one can, can go in there, and uh, 
yeah. Uh, let's just take a look at our backpacks. This is pretty full. This one is not. Let's see, what can we put in there? That, we are not going to need that. Uh, the maps, the radio. Can go. Two orange sodas. Can go as well. And the rest we keep. We keep this as a secondary bag. Uh, let's uh, save our axe. Attach it to our bag. That way in an emergency we can use it. Uh, but yeah, we could use a few more weapons. That would not be a bad idea. This nightstick is about to go and I don't think I have anything else that I can use. Uh, I have the unfork. But that's about it. Before we go, let's see, do I have anything that I can uh, eat uh, right off the can? Uh, canned potatoes, we'll have to do. Open the can. Put that in there. Let's see, 18 hunger. Uh, let's eat half of it. Let's see how uh, much does that uh, do for us. Package. Well, we... you'll take the rest for brunch. How about that? Hey, lady. This is a uh, private, uh, closed-off neighborhood. You are not allowed in here. Okay, guys. So uh, now we will have to make our way back to the place we were last night. Right? The fuck? I hear the zombie complaining. I thought it, they uh, were coming for us. Apparently not. Hey, lady. Come to me. Much better. So many flies. Uh, soon these corpses should uh, start decomposing, so... Uh, We will get uh, rid of the fly problem without doing anything uh, now because we uh, came through here uh, a couple of times now we should start to see a couple of zombies in the streets uh, we'll try to kill only those that we uh, need to because they are you know in our direct path and it's not a good thing to start accumulating zombies on the street. They will uh, create groups and uh, that will create problems for our, for us. And if we can avoid it, that is the best. But uh, yeah, not a lot of uh, movement in here. Hmm. I like it. Now this nightstick uh, is mm, kind of a bad uh, situation. We could use some pipes, some wrenches. Uh... Now, one of the first places that I want to loot after I get that uh... safe house is the school. Like the school has the potential to uh, spawn uh, bags, which is fantastic. Um, baseball bats, pipes, pipe wrenches, uh, meaning weapons for us. And uh, a key for that car, right? We could solve so many issues just by coming in here. If we're lucky, of course. Which, uh, uh, well, sometimes luck is on your lady. Luck is on your on your side, and other times it is not. So far, maybe we don't need to engage with these guys, or these guys over here. They have their backs turn turned on us, maybe they will not see us? Nope. Perfect. Just just keep on going. Take a free win, win when you can. Well, someone is coming. Yeah. 
this guy. You're gonna make a bunch of noise attracting all the zombies. Eat you. You are. Well, you were about to, but uh, no longer, right? Uh, these two probably will need to be taken care of. There is not a lot of room to maneuver, so let's just... Move towards the uh, danger. Great, okay. So, if we can get the safe house, at least we... Oh, shh. Where are they going towards? This way. Okay. Okay, they are coming. This just uh, sucks. We are all going towards the place we want to go. It's most likely that uh, one house, that um, one of those two-story buildings uh, had the alarm triggered. So they are all going towards that neighborhood. I'm gonna make it impossible to clear it. There we were talking about Lady Luck, right? Oh my god, I can only think the damage that house alarm just made, but uh, well, we would do uh, an house alarm. After all, we didn't add uh, any in the previous episode, so uh, we should consider ourselves lucky, and they are still coming, so we'll keep on moving in that direction. <sighs> Disgusting. Yeah, the Gigamar. All the employees from the Gigamar are now coming. Let's uh, try to make a run for it. Try to assess the damage later. Yeah. Things just went from manageable to painful. Shit. Okay. This is terrible. Just looping around this this tree. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Let's get out of here. Now, this neighborhood is quite uh, large, so uh, this is not the end of the world. Please no zombie, please no zombie, please no zombie, thank you. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. This is not a place to be. We don't want to be in here. We don't want to be in here. No, we do not. Okay, so uh, we are going to have to maneuver around this uh, new horde of zombies. And the way we do that is... Uh, uh, if we move in this direction, we have um, a lot of uh, stores uh, in the street that parallels this one. Uh, I'm pretty sure that all the zombies that were uh, located in that uh, commercial uh, area moved uh, in this direction. So let's just evacuate that area. Okay, let's forget about our plan. There's nothing we can do. Nothing. Oh my god, they are still coming. Oh shit. I, I thought we had lost them a couple of... Uh, uh, like if I was not exerted, I would fight them, but uh, I'm kind of exerted, so... Uh, really don't want to do uh, clearing uh, of zombies right now. Okay, maybe I'm not too exerted that I cannot do this. Come on, come on, come on. Come. Jump, what the fuck are you doing? Jesus. Nothing you can do about it. Okay. Back to losing and looting houses, I suppose. Zombies be like, bro, you think I'm that stupid? That I don't know the way around the fence? I'm disappointed with you, bro. And I'd be like, you know what, zombie? You are correct. 
I'm leading you straight to my place. Place that I was expecting uh, to live today. Apparently, I will not be able to do that. Huh. Okay, these houses have been looted. That house has not. So I have to fight for uh, for them now. Thanks to that alarm. <clears throat> okay, there are only four of them. So, fuck it. Let's do this. We are only a little bit exerted. So with a fire axe. These should be doable. Shh. Oh, that scared me. But uh, thank you. Thank you, game, for the uh, house alarm. No, you stay down. Could you please stop doing that? Thank you. Uh, okay. For now. We can take a moment to breathe. And uh, eat the rest of these potatoes. It's lunch time after all. But I think we are going to need a little bit more than that. Oh, that uh, might just do the trick. So, what should be our plan B? Hmm. Maybe... Uh, <coughs> try to move... Uh, that way now. Okay, we are no longer exerted. Let's just rest a little bit more. Just a few seconds more, pretty much. And uh, if we can get uh, over that fence, how am I gonna do that? There is a path over here that we can take. Okay, let's take a look down that path. Uh, there is very little room to maneuver, so we can get ambushed in here. Where are those zombies? I can hear them. But I can't see them. Okay, they're over there. They might just ignore us. Thank you, th Tree, for your uh, contribution. Very useful. Uh, okay, let's... Um Let's go through here. Man, we were so close yesterday. So close. Uh, yet again, if we had actually managed to get inside one of those houses, today we uh, would have to deal with the zombies from the house alarm. So, uh, when we put things into perspective, you know, maybe not being able to get in was not the worst thing that happened to us. And because I don't know what to do, I'm going to kill you! Uh, oh, the hardware shop. That's a good thing, a good find. Nice. Uh, a car and a couple of zombies? Hmm. Well, at least a game. Well, at least give me something, right? I just, uh, you know. Uh, spent the entire episode um, trying to achieve achieve th something and uh, got um, kind of busted. So um, throw me a little. Oh shit! I see that, and the game breaks my weapon. Okay. Uh, no gas. Engine busted and. The battery is busted. Okay. At least we have the key, right? Uh, in the trunk. First aid kit. Oh, nice. That's a good find. The tweezers can be used to remove the glasses. I didn't see any suture needles. Some more vitamins. Come on, take the vitamins from the nice lady. Uh, let's try this one. There is any uh, a zombie nearby, at least. I can hear him. I can hear you, zombie. Maybe it's that guy. Who cares? Locked. 
Yeah. Of course, everything is locked. Most likely than not, the car is in perfect driving condition. Yep. As gas, battery is not dead. Once again, once we get electrical level 1, we can break that window and get that car. That's not a bad car. It has uh, four seats, which allows us to get a lot of loot. And the trunk, I, I think, can handle uh, a lot of items. Uh, okay. No car for us in this parking lot. I mean, there are plenty of cars, but uh, no in no car in working condition. Man, hopefully this area is not um, filled with zombies. Like the alarm, most likely than not, uh, just draw them all all out, and um, we should be. Um, Another one coming. Yep. Kinda want to leave this place as clean as possible from zombies. Because we might need to get. Oh! Uh, chef uniform. We might need to come back, right? So if I can kill a zombie or two, I will. I just don't want to deal with large groups. Now let's go through here. The group of zombies that were over here got run out by the uh, uh, alarm. In fact, I don't see any zombies. Let's take a moment to smoke a cigar. We are a little bit anxious after all. Nice. And we get to check all these cars. So, let's see. You open? Nope. Is the trunk open? Yep, but it's empty. This one? No key. Uh, mint candy, sure. Okay, empty gas can. We need that. One piece of the puzzle. Solved. We know where are a few cars with gas. We can siphon. Uh, fill that gas can up. Right, right now I'm going to keep it uh, empty. But... Uh, for weight purposes, you know. Uh, but when we actually need the gas can... I'm actually gonna take the screwdriver in case we need uh, uh, another weapon. But uh, whenever we need it, we just... Whenever we need the gas, right, for the gas can, uh, for the generator to make the... Uh, uh, gas pump um, work can just come in here, siphon the gas and be golden we have two cars left couple of zombies moving towards us I see one I can't see the others hey zombie come here Uh, let's see, is this one uh, open? Nope, of course not. Obviously. What were you expecting? <laughs> uh, yeah. However, they seem to be in good condition, so... More possible... Possible candidates for our uh, future vehicle. Once again, electrical level 1 needs to be a priority, however, once we uh, manage to establish ourselves a uh, nice place, like one of these houses, because uh, these areas are not too populated, the house alarm was uh, somewhere around there, so uh, the zombies from here should be kinda gone. There is a group over there, and that, that's, that's pretty much it. All we need to do is clear a house, 
make it our uh, our home and uh, we're done okay so uh, first before we do anything okay I was going to eat something but okay let uh, let's eat these chips okay we have two zombies coming uh, let's speed up the process by bringing our trusty fire axe. I really don't want to use it too much. Because uh, it's a useful tool, but uh, even the situation that we are in, I don't think I can complain too much. Now, let's see. How are these windows? Are they busted? I can't see. Doesn't appear. To oh! Busted window. So we know this house doesn't have a house alarm, at least because a zombie has been in there. <laughs> right, we can patch that up. It's not a big deal. A few zombies on the back. Let's take care of these ugly bastards. Shit! Step on him. And uh, this door is busted. Okay, this house might not be safe to inhabit. Uh, we'll try the other one. But we can still loot it. And clearing zombies is never a bad thing, so... Progress is not wasted. Where did you come from? <sighs> okay. This house, then. Let's try to go for this one, and uh, once we have a, a place cleared out, we are going. We are gonna go for those zombies, and we are going to be done with it. Okay, all windows seems to be, seem to be in place. There is zombies in the back. I can hear them. Maybe are those zombies over there? Who knows? Uh, busted windows and a zombie over here busted windows is better than a busted door so given the circumstances right uh, and this is a, a busted window outwards so uh, a zombie came from that house outside probably her uh, I just wanted to see where this growling come from is coming from I kind of don't want to have any zombies in here, given that we have a broken window on this side, and a broken window on this side as well. And there are knocking inside, of course. This house is probably infested. And zombies are coming. Of course they are. Of course. Well, I would have to kill you anyway, so thank you. You saved me the trouble of going uh, towards your location. Okay, let's get inside. Let's try to prevent them from breaking more shit. Stop breaking my future safe house. Or at least one of the possible future safe houses. Okay, another zombie coming. Glad I uh, spotted you through the corner of my eye. Could you please come this way? Thank you. Gonna take that, because I want it. And it will serve as a uh, good weapon. Should we uh, need it, of course. Uh, take a look. I think it's this one knocking on this door, and uh, probably someone else... Hopefully this one is open. Oh shit, this one is locked. Of course it is! I didn't want to do this, but I will have to do it. I want to prevent him from breaking the door! Oh, thank god. Yoski, fantastic! Okay, let's clear the rest of the house. 
Another broken window. Ugh, Jesus. And no door to this uh, room. Which is uh, amazing. Let's get upstairs. Ready to swing. There it is, a zombie of here. <laughs> zombie cleared. Bathroom zombie? No bathroom zombie. Bathroom zo bedroom zombie? Nope. Nope. Cool. Okay, the house has been cleared. Uh, truth be told, it's not wonderful. No. And there are a lot of broken windows, but uh, given the situation... Okay, we are cool. Just so we don't attract any attention. Uh, now we need to go outside and uh, do a little bit of clearing. Make sure that we can spend the night in here safely. And not get our throats cut. Before we go, let me just... Oh, frying pan. This can work as a weapon. This can work as a weapon. Oh, shit. Game, don't you think you're uh, like uh, a being a little bit uh, trigger happy with the meta events? I think you're kind of going a little bit crazy on me. Okay, all this loot we can uh, sort uh, through this later. I just, first and foremost, I just want to make sure that uh, everything is cleared. You know, no zombies inside the house. Cool. Now, I want to go make sure the back is 100% zombie uh, free. Okay, uh, and the front zombie free as well. Okay, these zombies are over there, they will not bother us tonight, I'm pretty sure. That one might, uh, so I might need to kill her. Uh, on the back, any zombies, any zeds? That uh, part is uh, crucial. Uh, I don't know if our t it's what I hear. Oh my god. Please, game. Don't do this to me. I hate you sometimes. Oh, I... I uh, oh my god. What to do? What to do? Uh, go to the front. Yeah, go right through the tree, please. Uh, go to the front. Kill them as they come. Uh, they are fairly separated. I have a little bit of kiting room. Uh, not too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are coming. Oh shit. They are coming right to my... Hey! Hey! Psst! Okay, I sprinted a little bit just to uh, draw their attention. So that they don't uh, go towards the back. Let's try to annihilate them as quickly as we possibly can. Get away from me. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. I should have popped the uh, 8 beta blocker. I forgot. I shouldn't kite too much more than this. Okay, let's uh, give ourselves a little bit of uh, breathing room. There's nothing on our back. Let's start slicing and dicing. We need... Come on, start popping those guys to the floor. No, go away. Go away. Oh, Jesus. That was stressful. You know what, for... Uh, because uh, there are more zombies to clear, just take a beta blocker. And I know I am exerted, but at least I will not be um, panicking. Making sure every swing, uh, swing counts. Okay. Any more? Because now I have to go to the back and clear the rest of them again. I kind of wanted to use a few minutes to uh, disassemble some furniture and uh, fortify those windows, but thank you, Meta Event 4.0. 
for uh, that. I just need to clear these guys and make sure that uh, no one is over here in the back, once again. Okay. I don't hear any zombies now. I don't see any zombies now. We might just have done it. Okay. There is no one in the immediate vicinity, so uh, we have a, qu a safe... And they, I say there is a safe corner, and these guys j are just... just going. I have to clear them. I can't leave them alive. For safety's sake. Okay, that guy just want to go. Okay, if he just want, wants to go, uh, fine by me. These four, however, these five, I mean, uh, these have to go. Come on, come on, uglies. <laughs> to the floor. Okay, I just wanted uh, one of them, but okay, all of them should do just fine. If I have to deal with you. At least I'm not panicking, right? At least that. Come on, drop him! Oh, fantastic. Area is uh, relatively clear. Let's get inside. And try to disassemble some stuff. Let's try to disassemble some stuff that we might not need, like for example... No this table. Chance 15. Oh, if I get one plank, I am happy, okay? Because I can uh, block one window and not have them uh, flow through the, the house like wind uh, during the night while I sleep, okay? One plank. And a few nails, okay? That is all welcome. I have four nails now, I believe. Yep. So we have one play one plank. Saw a garden hammer. But what? Don't I have a garden hammer? Oh I left it uh, back at home. Alright. <clears throat> uh we will be able to do one window though. And this one. Can this one be disassembled? Nope. Can this be disassembled? Nope. This? Unfortunately, no. Okay. Okay. One window. It's better than nothing. Right? Um, let's let's first and foremost pick up the... Uh, oh, but we don't have gloves, so we might cut ourselves. So let's block it from the outside. I have a garden uh, saw in my um, in my bag on the other um, safe house, but um, unfortunately, given the fact that we didn't bring it with us, we might not get a lot more than this for safety. We could use just like I think two more, one for this one and one for this one, and at least all entrances would be blocked. Uh, let's go upstairs. Maybe we can find something. We can disassemble. It is secretary. Yep. It's 
the lightwood desk and can be disassembled. Let's uh, take it apart. Close the wind the curtains afterwards. Unfortunate. But uh, not unexpected, right. Can uh, I disassemble this? Nope, I cannot. But I can um, get a, free, uh, a fresh uh, set of clothes. Uh, we can use this for... Um, ooh, soap. We can uh, wash ourselves in the river. And some bleach. Oh, thank you. Thank you. We can uh, put our um, axe away now. Because we have a baseball bat. Oh, fan freaking fantastic. It's going to be put away as well. Great. And we have a couple of video games to uh, disassemble. When um, we find a electrical uh, for beginners. Uh, did I search in here? There is nothing to search, so no point. Uh, I'm pretty sure I cannot dis. I can disassemble the door. Maybe that would give us a couple of uh, planks. Huh? Like I don't need this door over here. Let's disassemble it. Why is this not attached to my back? You failed to produce any useful materials. Amazing. <laughs> oh. Okay, uh, let's close this curtain over here. Uh, next episode, when we start uh, reading the other houses, we should uh, get a couple of uh, curtains to um, block the windows off. We could go for um, search that. Is uh, Esper? Oh, I can't say that. You you guys saw that. <laughs> Esper, e expert. Jesus Christ! My tongue uh, gave a knot and a twist uh, when I tried to uh, say that. Jesus. Yeah. Okay. The entire house have been, has been searched. We have uh, a couple of good things which we are going to leave in here because uh, there is no point in uh, looting uh, our future safe house, right? Just take a quick look outside. I don't see uh, nothing. There is a tree in the way, so close those curtains as well. Uh, in fact, we can even un unload a couple of uh, things in here, for now, uh, to uh, lighten our load a little bit, like the broken nightstick. We're not going to do nothing with that. Uh, the empty gas can can go in there. Uh, garbage bag, first aid kit. We should keep on us. Uh, in fact, what I'm gonna do, guys. It's quite simple. I'm going to put the first, first aid kit on the ground. And I'm going to put everything in there. Uh, the sterilized rag we can use as a bandage. Uh, the ripped sheets, nope. We'll not uh, do nothing with those. Uh, we can use those for um, a rope, I mean. Uh, but that, let's not use those as uh, healing items, given that we already have enough. Uh, the scissors can stay in there. Oh, the vitamins can go up there. Didn't I have an additional bottle of uh, beta blockers? I thought I had two bottles. Or did I already put it in there? It's already in there. I'm being stupid. Uh, yeah, that's all our medical items. That way, if we need it, what we can do, we have the first aid kit, right, on us. We just come here and we equip it as secondary. And then we will have um, quick access to all our medical supplies instead of, in a panic, trying to search where are my bandages? Where are my bandages? I can't see my bandages! Th that one is uh, much easier, you know? Uh, for panic purposes, of course. Um, the container itself, um, 
weighs a little bit, so uh, we are adding unnecessary weight to ourselves, but uh, for panic purposes, I think that's uh, actually a good idea. Oh, sorry guys. But uh, in any case, I think uh, we had um, enough fun for one day. We are extremely tired, extremely hungry, and extremely mo <laughs> exerted. Not extremely, but, you know, moderately exerted. So, I think we are going to take advantage of the safety that we have uh, claimed for ourselves. We are going to smoke one final cigarette today. Eat some cookies, because we deserve them. And then, uh, in fact, I'm going to make a, a bowl of oatmeal instead of uh, a cookie. It's uh, it's good food to have before bed, you know. M make sure that uh, you will not be uh, hungry during the night. And yeah, guys, I hope that... Uh, oh shit, that's not what I wanted to do, as I was about to say. Um, I hope that you uh, as have... Um, enjoy this episode and that uh, you are enjoying this uh, series so far. If you are, please consider subscribing and help the channel grow. But uh, in the meantime, this is the base manager signing out. Bye bye!